afternoon, boys and girls. I am outside my house. I am going to get ready to plant some flowers with my daughter, Kalia. Ew. And my husband when he gets out here. I'm going to show you the plants that I planted last year. Just a moment. This is my peppermint plant that I planted last year. It grew back. I'm so happy it did because I thought it wasn't going to. Um, I just cleaned out the leaves that were in there and other things because the squirrels got into it. I have this. I don't even remember what that was because I didn't label it last year. But it was two different plants in there. One is growing really tall. I have some little plants growing up in there. And then the big ones. Here's another one that I made last year. And I was going through cleaning all the leaves out and the squirrels had put acorns in there. And there is an acorn sprouting in there. So now it's going to be an acorn tree. Pretty cool. This year I went and got four of the same kind of buckets from the Dollar Tree. We gotta pop these little things out at the bottom so that the water will go through and not sit on top of our plants. Got our watering can. We have our little troll. And we have a package of potting soil. We are going to do Shasta daisies in one pot. Sweet Williams in one pot. Cosmos in another pot. And Xenas. How do you pronounce that, Kalia? What's that? Xena? Xena? I don't know. They're pretty. So I'm going to plant them. Kalia, the out of it. don't be busting holes in the flower pots. Okay, so we found out that you have to be very careful when you're poking your holes out. You put a hole in the bottom of the pot. We're going to have to improvise with maybe some saran wrap to keep it from keep the soil from falling out the bottom. Take this troll and scoop the soil into the pot. <laughs> you can sit on the ground. This is something we will be doing in the classroom if we were in the class. We will be painting planting flowers. Yes, we'll be painting. <laughs> no hush. I know I mess up a lot. Okay, so first I'm going to start with these. I got my soil in. I'm going to poke a hole in the soil. Could be big holes, little holes, depending on where you want to put them. I think I'm going to make three holes and put a little seed in every hole. This is what those seeds look like worms or something. <laughs> I'm gonna drop a couple in this hole. And then cover it up. Make another hole. Put some in there. Cover it up. Make one more hole. Put some in there. Cover it up. And then I'm going to repeat this step for all the other flowers. Oh yeah. By the way, I got these flowers from the Dollar Tree for 50 cents. My bad. They were 25 cents a package. This is what the zinni seeds look like. 
They look like pumpkin seeds. Next, it's the Shasta daisies. Lost some more. They look like these. Sweet William. See what these look like. Little black seeds. <coughs> That's your pink. Spread them out. So Cover it up. Some in there, there we go. And some in there. Cover it up. Okay. Water. Put a little water on each point. No more. Don't be scared. It's going to rain tomorrow, so we're not going to put a whole lot. Go. No. I don't think this going to be enough. We got some water over there in the, in the bins with the rain been catching. And put a little bit more soil on these three from last year. So they can go up healthy and strong. Oh! We're gonna put some water on them. Set them outside and we're all done. <laughs>